President Biden is hitting the road again to talk up his trillion dollar infrastructure package. Meanwhile, the man dubbed the QAnon Shaman during that Capitol siege has been sentenced to prison now for his role in the riot. Our DC Bureau Chief Ben Kennedy live with more. Hey, Ben. Hey, Christy Calvin, this man was a key figure in the Capitol riot and will now spend the next 41 months behind bars. 34 year old Jacob Chansley, the man dubbed the QAnon shaman during the Capitol riot, faced a judge Wednesday and was sentenced to more than three years in prison for his role during the siege. He sought to be accountable. He was and has been held accountable. Mr. Chansley owned his responsibility. On January 6, he appeared shirtless, wearing face paint and a horned headdress while he led others through the Capitol. Federal prosecutors argued Chansley showed little remorse after the attack and wanted a longer sentence so his case could be used as an example. In the meantime, today in D.C., President? President Biden left the White House for Michigan to promote the bipartisan infrastructure plan he signed into law this week. <laughs> Biden's trip comes a day after he traveled to New Hampshire to doubt how the $1.2 trillion will repair the nation's roads, bridges, and rail. When you see these projects starting in your hometowns, I want you to feel what I feel, pride. Pride of what we can do together. And Democrats still want to pass the president's larger spending package, $1.75 trillion, which invests in climate, education, and health care. They want to get that done before Thanksgiving, which is a week from tomorrow. Live at the White House, Ben Kennedy, Local 10 News.